everyone, welcome everybody. This is Spiritual Findings with a Gypsy Soul. I am your Gypsy, Vera Lynn. And today we're going to be doing a general reading for my Capricorns for June 2019. Now this general reading is going to cover your love, your career, your soul story, what's going on for June. Okay guys, um, we did have a few retrogrades back in April. We have one for June. Okay, that will be happening on the 20th. Neptune will be going retrograde retrograde okay all right so yeah we got a lot of retrograde feelings going on guys but don't let that discourage you it's supposed to shake things up for you and everybody around you but that's because sometimes in life chaos brings change good change change that we needed okay sometimes things need to kick us out of us out of our comfort zone to really change things to get motivated with your education your career okay your love life finding somebody all right so i had one pop out there i am also having a giveaway for the month of june and july anybody who shares subscribes likes and also likes our facebook page here with spiritual findings with a gypsy soul will have a chance at a free giveaway which i have a care basket here guys lots of good things in here i have incense tapestry epsom salts i have some sage two different types this is my camera lens so that's not included <laughs> two different types of sage i have the green and white they're farm raised because you have to worry about the white sage being endangered guys okay so just be careful on where you get your white sage and also a tarot deck for i know a lot of my subscribers you know really really have a passion for reading tarot themselves and i'm going to get in some to, into some tarot study videos for you guys which you know if you want to subscribe and more importantly ring that notification bell and also a salt lamp too for you guys so this is a little care basket for some of my subscribers just like comment share um, ring that notification bell. I do a lot of live streams here too as well. You can get yourself a free reading So ring that notification bell and it'll tell you when I'm doing a live stream It's also really fun to chat with you guys. It's an educational community as well as you might get a free reading I do paid reading too on there as well. I love it. It's a lot of fun All right My Capricorns. let's see here Hmm, we got an interesting layout here for June. What is going on? I had a card come out this way, horizontal. All right, so you're a little sideways with your work here, Capricorn. Maybe you're not quite sure if you want to try a new job, a new line of work, maybe some education. You're kind of on halt with it, okay? You're not really quite sure if you wanna take that leap yet, which that's fine, don't worry. You know, maybe you need to put it on pause and worry about other st stuff in your life, which right now with the Empress and the Magician popping out, it seems like you need to focus on your feminine side, your loving side, your nurturing side, as well as your spirituality. Maybe you need to put that that focus of career on the back burner for now. And don't forget about it completely, you know, maybe still take them steps to change it, but focus on your, you know, not necessarily your love life, but the things that you love to do, the things that inspire you, whether it's art, you know, singing music, poetry, you know, a long list of things that could make you happy, go out and do it. Kind of discover yourself again, as well as embrace your spirituality side. You know, maybe you do need, you know, this tarot deck here here in the giveaway basket because you need to kind of open up buy a couple books you know listen to some audio maybe watch some YouTube videos and whatever it is that attracts you whether it's meditation tarot reading you know crystals earthing it could be a wide variety of different things okay I highly recommend um, what's it called spirit science it's a cute little video a little cartoon that kind of just it's good for beginners people who are just diving into spirituality which i know a lot of you guys are so so we also have a battle too there might be something right now that you're kind of putting your guard up kind of making you know a brick wall between you and that problem whatever it might be it could be a toxic ex it could be maybe a reputation that you've had in the past that's still you know kind of lingering around with what people think of you now whatever it might be you need to release those fears release that anxiety depression that's holding you back release it what no longer serves you Capricorn release it let it go okay maybe it's just even fears about yourself 
doesn't have to be what other people think about you, but what you think about yourself, Capricorn. I know you guys can be very critical, almost up there with my Virgos. Um, my Capricorns are very disciplined, okay? You kind of think by the book and go by the book, okay? So if you mess up, if you had to mess up along the way, you know, don't let that judge your future. Don't punish yourself now for something that happened in the past, okay? Let it go, all right? Okay, so let's see here. Um, yeah, I mentioned before I do a lot of live stream, guys. It's a lot of fun chatting with you guys, throwing out some educational information, something about spirituality. Where are you guys from? I love hearing from my subscribers. If I don't catch you for a live stream, go, don't be shy. Comment below. I love hearing from you guys. All right. Okay, so let's see here. I'm thinking one from the angels. Who are my Capricorns for June 2019? Is there any extra insight, guidance, some inspiration that they may need for June 2019? Let's see here, guys. This is a message from the angels. All right, it seems like we got two. They just wanted to come out of the deck. All right, so let's see here. We have five of earth, fears surrounding money, the wisdom to accept help from others, uncertain self-employment. I really feel, guys, that this ties in with the eight of pentacle horizontal, how it just fell out of the deck like that. In the beginning, you could see that. All right, so five of earth, guys. I think you really need to let those fears Go. what no longer serves you those you know for fear surrounding money and future career paths just let it go okay don't let it really overwhelm you okay and just kind of consume you because you have a lot of options out there Capricorn all right don't get yourself worked up over the small little details. Let it go, okay? And we also have the Knight of Air, intelligent, idealistic, tireless, events that occur with great speed. Take time to carefully review your options, creative solutions. And I think with the creative solutions, that kind of ties in with the Empress and the Magician here, okay? They're kind of on your side. So for the month of June, just don't forget your feminine side, your, you know, value of the arts, um, just the simple things, romance, beauty, you know, whatever it is, have a little fun with it, make the summer a little hot and heavy, okay? And you have the Magician. Read that literature, audiobooks those videos, whatever it is, master meditation in the summer, something needs to happen with your spiritual side, okay? And you're ready. Once you kind of dive into it and you know what you want, you will be ready to knock down these walls, Capricorn. All right, here, let's zoom in on this card. Night of Air, okay? I will zoom in on the whole spread here, too, for you guys at the end of the video. And that pretty much does sum us up, guys. All right, you have a nice spread here. You got a little work to do for June, but, you know, it's not out of your reach. Don't feel overwhelmed, okay? Those retrogrades were meant to shake things up. <laughs> you might have gotten a few messages that kind of knocked you off your rocker, whether it was before June or maybe even during June, but don't worry, it needed to happen. It needed to shake things up so you can kind of, you know, pick yourself up, dust yourself off, and know which path you need to take. Okay, Capricorn. All right, so once again, don't forget about the care box, guys. My goal is for by my birthday, August 31st, I would like to reach 8,000 subscribers. I'm taking a new little personal twist on the channel, as some of you guys might see, but I am dedicated to my tarot readings, reaching out and helping to you guys. So with your help, if you would kindly subscribe, share this video to any social media, ring that notification bell if you feel up to it. Also like the Facebook page, which is in the link listed below. And at the end of June, or I'm sorry, the end of July, the very last day of July, I will be doing a live stream where if you've done all this and you comment comment it below the name that you want you know for me to write on a card and put in a hat just let me know okay let me know that you're interested and I will shuffle a 
big hat with all these names at the end of July and pick a winner live stream. And even if your name doesn't get picked, maybe you'll get a free reading, you know, while we wait, okay, for the raffle to go off. This giveaway, whatever you might want to call it. But yeah, so you got a deck of cards, you got sage, incense, Epsom salts. Oh, and I also, all the way down here, I got a little care package of gemstones, okay? You got a wide variety of different gemstones. You have carnelian, different quartz, hematite, adventuring. You have all different kinds of cute crystals in there and a salt lamp too as well. The tapestry here is really cute. It is of all the horoscope signs there. There you go, that's what the tapestry looks like. So go ahead, share, get out there. You know, I love hearing from you guys and I think this contest will be fun and we'll see where this channel will grow over the next couple months. All right. Okay, guys, thanks for tuning in. This is Spiritual Findings with a Gypsy Soul. I am your Gypsy, Vera Lynn. You guys have a beautiful June.